When COVID hit, David Skeels wanted to help. So when vaccines became available, he volunteered to work at a clinic. But the slots here in Indianapolis were filled. But online, he saw there was a great need at clinics in Evansville. So he packed up and he headed south. It's going to feel really empty without him here. And that's because David Skeel has been there since the beginning. Uh, Kelly's uh, right in the center. She can direct you to the next vaccinator. Okay. Volunteering at the Ascension St. Vincent COVID clinic in Evansville. Of course, I miss, uh, I miss my wife and, uh, and daughter who are in, 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 in Indianapolis. But uh, uh, yes, I've, I've made some really good friends. And he certainly had a lot of time to bond, working 12 hours a day at various volunteer posts. First, staying at a hotel. So after I talked to my family uh, and said I'm, I'm thinking about signing up for the long haul, uh, I signed up for a week. That was back in early February. Then he moved to an Airbnb and committed to staying for months. I signed up for as many shifts uh, and I figured if I was here I was going to work both shifts. There was no reason I had to uh, uh, take an afternoon off. I've essentially covered a wall almost floor to ceiling with the pictures of all the volunteers that are helping out in here. We could not do it without our volunteers. On any given shift, half of the workers here are just like David, donating their time. We're all here either because we lost somebody to COVID or we um, feel compelled that it's something important to do for the country and, and the world. Dave is 58, newly retired, and values that he has this time where he can put other people first. It, it has uh, definitely helped me become a better me. But back home in Indy, spring has sprung. Photos reveal that his yard is taking off, and though they visited, his family is really ready to reunite. And so this is his last day at the Evansville Clinic. His extreme dedication rewarded with gifts, a celebration, a coronation even, naming David the Corona King of Evansville. Outside, they serve up a local favorite stromboli for everyone to thank the man who came to give and now leaves with even more. This is a tiny little drop, but uh, I've told a lot of volunteers the tiny little drops fill up buckets, so that's uh, that's kind of what we're all up against and working, working for. It's just an honor to do it. Dave says that he did lose three relatives to COVID-19 and the work at the clinic really gives him time to grieve and honor their lives. Now, if you happen to be getting a shot this afternoon and you go to the Ascension Clinic on the north side, you'll likely see Dave because there was an open slot this afternoon and he signed mm. up to volunteer.